Welcome to this week's Reading Report. We're your hosts, Malin Erdeljack and Brooke Morris. Here's a message from the administration. Hey there, Reading Junior High, Mr. Rangel. Hopefully you had a great weekend. Just looking forward to another good week. Uh, man, we got the eclipse today. Hopefully it doesn't rain or it's not it's too cloudy. Uh, hopefully we get to enjoy that. We won't see another eclipse for 20 years. So. Yeah, I'll be in my 30s by that time. Also, uh, just a couple of reminders, man. Make sure we're taking care of our grades. We've got STAR coming up. Get your rest. Get sleep. Uh, make sure you're ready to go. Uh, also, with the grades, man, we're doing Saturday school uh, again. And, again, I get to be pay- I'm paid to be there. And so, yeah, if you don't get your stuff done Monday through Friday, well, then I'll be calling your parents, and you'll be with me on Saturday. Uh, a couple of other things, yeah, watch your behavior in the hallways. Uh yeah, and the last thing I always tell you, if you need something, uh, man, I hated school when I was in junior high. I know, and look what I do, and look where I'm at every day. Uh, it's just because, yeah, stuff was happening, life was happening, and so yeah, we got counselors here, we have your teachers here, we have so many people who are here for you. So if you need anything, just let us know. Have a great week. Here's this week's counselors' corner. Hello, Reading Junior High students and family members. Welcome to another week at Junior High Life. We have upcoming stars, so good luck to everybody. Also, for incoming seventh and incoming eighth graders, please turn in your course selection worksheet signed by your parent if you have not done so already. Have a great week. Hey, Longhorns, this is Coach Soul. Um, Not only do I do cheer, but if you didn't know, I am also the testing coordinator here at Reading. Uh, If you didn't know, you do have star tests coming up. I know your teachers have been preparing you guys to be successful on those tests. Um, Just wanted to give you just a little tidbits um, to make sure that you are successful as far as being ready and then uh, becoming here taking the test. Um, To get ready for STAR, um, definitely make sure you're paying attention um, to all of those reviews that your teachers are going over with you. Um, Day of STAR, make sure you know you get a good breakfast, you know where you're going to test, you have all your materials and supplies that you need. Um, I always say lunch is important. Um, So just make sure if you want to bring a lunch that day, make sure you prepare for that, snacks, anything of that nature that will um, help you to get through. It's going to be a long day, so get ready. Make sure you take your time and use all those strategies that your teachers have taught you. Um, You know, after STAR is very important as well. Um, Just making sure you're looking over to see how you did and what things that you can approve upon for next year. Um, As STAR comes closer, I will begin uh, sending out information. I know there's gonna be some dates, information like that in this uh, Sunday s'more. So make sure you look at that so you know what days you're taking what tests. And my office is here in the library. So if you need any information or if you need any help with anything related to STAR, I am your go-to person. A solar eclipse occurs when the moon passes between the Earth and the sun, casting a shadow on the Earth. Total solar eclipses are rare events that can be observed only from specific locations on Earth. Partial solar eclipses are more common than total eclipses and can be observed from a wider area. You must wear special glasses. The upcoming total solar eclipse will last longer than the 2017 eclipse. Coach Walker's journalism classes completed their ad campaign unit in the Shark Tank last week. A big shout out goes to all the teachers and staff who helped out.
Big congrats to our JV guard on their second place finish at the TCGC Area Championships in their round tonight and second place in Scholastic JV SRA out of 28. And congrats to Cadet Guard for placing fourth at TCGC this weekend. As with any team, you have to start from somewhere. This team has set the standard really high for their development in the guard program. The future is bright. joining us on this week's writing report. Go, Go Horns! horns!